Hey guys, in this video I just wanted to talk a little bit about Dota 2, which is Defense of the Ancients 2. It's a free-to-play game on the uh, Steam network. You can just go ahead and log into Steam, search for Dota 2, and download it for free. You can play it for free, and um, it doesn't have uh, it doesn't have like a pay-to-win microtransaction service. Uh, the, the microtransactions uh, primarily revolve around aesthetic items, and that is the focus of this particular video. In this case, you can actually earn commissions with Dota 2 if you're a graphic artist and you would like to use Blender or another program to do some 3D modeling and submit those uh, items that you create to Dota 2, they will be reviewed and if they are accepted and added to the, the store, you will earn a percentage of the sales on those items. And uh, this web page that you see on screen here talks about uh, how you can do that and they have some uh, frequently asked questions and some uh, links to some tutorials that talk about 3D modeling and in some other areas like uh, here what software tool should I use to make my item and they have suggestions like Maya, Photoshop, ZBrush, 3D Coat, 3D Studio Max and a number of other programs and that's kind of a cool thing for any aspiring artists, graphic artists. Uh, I happen to know a few myself and um, I've uh, let them know about this ability to generate residual income uh, as well as to showcase their work. Uh, Dota has, they, 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 pro, they claim to have more than six million, almost six and a half million unique visitors this month and there is always at least 150,000 players online at any given time uh, in the time that I've played the game. Uh, that is according to to Valve and the stats that are advertised in game. Uh, so anyway, if you're interested in doing something of this nature, I suggest that you look down below in the video description where there will be a link to this page and you can go ahead and read through it, click some of the, the help links and the FAQs and the tutorials and so forth and uh, from there you can you can get started uh, on your own project of uh, 3D modeling and it, here at the top you know they got the quick links probably the the thing that you want to look at first is going to be the technical requirements you know because you don't want to spend a bunch of time developing something that they're not going to accept so anyway I hope you enjoyed the video and for some of you this might be an interesting way to earn a bit of extra money in a passive uh, manner at, after of course you put in the work and that about concludes this video guys hope it's uh, helped some of you go ahead and leave a comment in the section below like and don't forget to subscribe you'll be able to catch future videos so much easier thanks for watching we'll see you in the next video